Anyway, we're back rolling in on barbecue, a little barbecue grill. It's right up here, matter of fact, a little bitty grill. got the barbecue grill I'm sure the guy that owns it is probably not very happy about his grill the grill getting taken pretty certain it's not the next time he wants to grill out he's gonna be he's gonna be pissed off I guarantee that you gonna have to come get it man evidently uh, somebody at his building over there is complaining about his barbecue grill taking up valuable parking. Hey, we're back on another one. We got to load up one. We're in Riverdale right now. We got a, a, we got some kind of a wrecked car. Anyway, we're gonna load it up. And see what happens. Anyway, it's a lower end property here, and I'd be willing to bet a full paycheck that they don't tow uh, that much. But uh, like I said before, man, the wrecked cars, you leave cars wrecked. Now here's an example of what I was saying. They don't tow that much. These cars are parked on that yellow curb. They're parked in the fire lane, and they're not calling them in to tow. Like I said, this property here is not really that proactive on towing. They don't tow that much, but wrecked cars are gonna get yanked. Can't leave a wrecked car on the property. I don't care if it's a rundown property or an up uppity property. You're gonna get the car's gonna get yanked, man. Anyway, y'all stay tuned. We got more coming. Roll to the yard. Anyway, we just pulled up one of my favorite dealerships over here, and they've got uh, what they've got is they've got a handicap parking sheeter parked in the front. Just left his car parked in a handicap spot without a placard on it. So they uh, they're. Uh, they're towing it. He said it's top priority. It's got to go. It's Chrysler 300 right here behind me.
Ну. too much Carmack stuff on the uh, on the channel talk too much about Carmax but uh, I towed for them for a lot of years this particular store right here is a uh, is a fantastic store and they've uh, like I said I towed out of here for 10 years and uh, they hey every every person I've ever dealt with uh, at Carmax it treated me very very respectfully uh, and I got a lot of friends that work at this, this store. Uh, they actually, uh, uh, CarMax does not like people parking in their handicap spot. I can tell you that. You better not park there very long or they will tow you if you don't, if you don't have a placard. If you're not handicapped, don't park in their spot. Anyway, we got one more car we're getting out of here. This is a dealer car. The dealers leave their cars after they buy them at the auction, they leave them here. And they wind up getting towed. I'm gonna get out and check this Acura and see if it's got a, a rear wheel, uh, if it's got a rear drive on it. That front axle looks like it's out on that Panamera. No tag, MDX. Yeah, this thing's gonna have to be uh, flat bedded. I think I think I may call this in. I may call this right here in and let somebody else come get the MDX or the other one I got here and just take one at a time. I'm not trying to hog all the calls. You gotta share the calls with the other drivers because they gotta make money too.